race won a right Pioneer Square for Candace Dawson. I don't know much about this horse, but of the race runners, the field looks quite thin. So if he's got any ability, I'm sure he's in with a good chance. Race three, a right ambitious lady for Corey Lensley. She's got a terrible draw again. Um, probably going to have to ride her quietly early in the race. Um, her last run wasn't a bad run. Uh, she carried 60 kilos and had to give a lot of weight away to the rest of the field. Uh, this time round, we're in a normal maiden plate, so I give her a chance, but we need, need a bit of luck in run. Race seven, I write Quantum Theory for the Robbie Sage Yard. He's quite an interesting horse, this. Uh, he's run some fantastic races and he's run some below par races. So I think if we've got him in the right mood on the day, I think he's in with a really good chance. I think we've got Dice to beat, but um, if I can get this boy's mind on the job, I'm sure he's in with a great chance. Race eight, I ride Samoa for the Bridget Sidoff stable. Uh, her last run was brilliant. Uh, in a fix came out and won again. Um, I think if she can reproduce that run, she's in with a very good chance. In saying that, she's a 10-year-old mare and another horse that you, <laughs> you've got to get her in the right mood. Gone really well for me in the past and I'm looking very forward to riding her.